Game On Magazine is joined by netball Protea shooter Lenise Bortriter. Thank you very much, Lenise, for joining us today. Oh, thank you for having me today. <laughs> Lenise, you've played netball your whole life, but if we could look at your post-matric netball career, you went from an under-21 tux player to now a Protea shooter. If you look back on this journey, what is the biggest moments that made the difference? Oh, definitely my coaching staff that helped me through everything, including my fitness, my skills, my um, personality wise on court, off court. So I think it's um, thanks to them that I've grown into this netball player, um, especially for how hard they're working me and how they just want the best for me. So I think it's definitely um, moving to Turks and then getting the appropriate coaching that yes. I think they give us. Was there any specific moments in those years of development that you realized you had the potential to be a Protea netball player? <laughs> um, I never actually thought that I would be a Protea, uh, Protea netball player. Um, I just went on court the one um, weekend uh, when we were playing Brutal Fruit and then the evening I got a call from the selector telling me they're pulling me up into the Protea squad and I was like, whoa, <laughs> I did not expect that at all. Really? Yes. And what was your family's reaction at that point? Oh, well, I just phoned them because they didn't come and watch the game because they didn't think I would play. Um, but when I phoned them, I think I heard my mom cry. Oh, wow. <laughs> but you're off tears, of course. And my dad was just like, really? So he was also very confused like I was. Yes, and now playing as a Pretia, what have you discovered to be the biggest challenge on courts and how do you manage that challenge? Um, because I'm a shooter, I know the biggest challenge for me is to get a 90 plus average per game, but we all know no one is perfect, so that doesn't happen every game. So my pressure is to just maintain that standard, especially in the Turks team and the Pretia team to lift uh, my teammates spirit and by that I can help them also better themselves by putting confidence in them for having confidence in me. Yes. So I think that's the most important thing for me as well to manage is to just stay calm while shooting and not overthink my shot. Mm -hmm. So I'm just literally relaxed and thinking of a bar one milkshake while shooting. Sure. So yeah. <laughs> and your latest test series with the Proteas was against Wales. Was there any moments that stand out or any challenges you faced in that series? I'm um, coming back from England, my self-confidence was a bit low, so it was challenging getting on court, especially for the Pritias again, um, to get my confidence back and to get my average up again, but I think with my teammates that boosted me and telling me, no, I deserve to be there and they have confidence in me to get those shots in, that already helped so much. So, um, yes, challenge was to get the 90% average, which I think I did get, um, and the standout was getting the player of the series at the end of the series and one of my best friends she's the shooter of Wales getting the shooter of the series so we were just like yes this is how we roll yes <laughs> well you know as you develop in this career and you're getting you know player of the tournament you look up to players like Irene van Dijk and as you develop your career if you could maybe get to a position where she is one day and younger Proteas look up to you like you, you look up to her what qualities about yourself would you want them to aspire to um, I just want them to, like I said, especially shooters, not overthink their shots because sometimes I meet those small girls and they're saying they don't know what you think about when they shoot and they're stressing so much and the pressure is on and all those things and I'm just like, girls relax, um, it is your job, you are chosen for the job for a specific reason, um, you were made to be a shooter so it is in your genes so just chill it out, um, take the shot if you miss, it's not like you miss on purpose. Yes. You try your best. You just have to have to have the confidence in your teammates to defend the ball and bring it back to you. And then after that, you have to put in the shot. Yes. You stepped onto the netball court for the first time when you were in grade three. <laughs> if you could speak to that little girl now, what would you tell her, and would you do anything differently? Um, I would definitely tell her to have a bit more of a poker face <laughs> and not show emotion so much on court, because that is my downfall. Um, that was and still is my downfall since I was little, um, showing too much emotion on court. So I just tell it to, if I get nervous or frustrated or angry or sad, I should just keep it to myself for a little while um, until the game is over and then after the game I can run to rave as much as I want to. Alright, well thank you very much Lenise.